Okay, good morning, everyone. How are you guys? We need more people to speak today, right? Let me hear what's going on, what's up there. Like, uh, give uh, almost 19 people on the call. Can we hear from others here? Hello, everyone. How are you? How are you guys? You can open your mic and say something before we start. We're starting our today, Sunday. Um, good morning. How are you? I'm good. How are you doing? We are good, fine, good. man. How are you? Good morning. How are you? Okay, amazing. That's amazing. Thank you so much. So, um, uh, maybe I can go through today's schedule as we're starting. So today, that's just uh, stand up. There's stand up uh, starting now. And after that, uh, we're going to have uh, day three tutorial introduction to financial indicators. Then after that, that will be uh, 12 p.m. That's uh, East African time, but you can uh, convert your time zone. Yeah. Then after that, we have community building session. I would also invite you guys for our today's community building session. I don't know what's actually wrong. Maybe is it like maybe your time or something? Most people don't just uh participate within community building session i don't know what's wrong what might be the the, the reason maybe is it maybe time is it maybe you know you get challenged with slack i would also love to hear about this if maybe you have any any comment or maybe challenge about that like why people doesn't participate uh, in community building session on slack what's the challenge is it maybe the corner we can change do you maybe have an idea we can also hear about that as well then at the community viewing session, um, we have uh, tutorial, another tutorial, day three tutorial, career challenge, introduction. Then that will be it for today. Then after that, I think we have independent challenge work, which is actually independent, of course. Yeah, then that's the, uh, the schedule of today. Uh, then um, if there is no question about that, we can just open the space for everyone. What was yesterday? What are you up to do? Uh, what are you up for today? Like, what are you doing today? What, how was yesterday? Is there any challenge, maybe any problem, or anything else you'd love to communicate or to say? It's your time. The space is open to you guys. But before that, maybe, let's just start with the community building sessions. Like, what's up? Like, if there may be any problem with timing or challenge with Slack or something, because I get few perspectives most of the time. Time. If someone miss time, the timing. Yeah, yeah time. it's lunch time, man. Yeah, so I think lunch time is bad because it's time to relax and because uh, community building sessions are just relaxing and having fun, you know. Yeah, challenging each other. I think it's it was the best timing. But uh, it's, 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 mm -hmm. you know, as as Africans, lunch time is a very it's time for food we cannot participate while eating food is food alone do you have any suggestion maybe of the timing maybe community building should be immediately after this stand up after stand up yeah then but what about but still the the sessions or maybe the interaction in the, on, on slack on community building channel it's not actually like even something like you have to do directly that time you can still contribute after, but when you get time, because just maybe when you're doing check-in, like uh, maybe uh, when it's check-in, you can just come, uh, hey, this is today and we did this, maybe this was the challenge, something that. For us to even know like how you're doing, maybe if there's a challenge, you can help you. If there's a challenge, you can help this this side or something like that. Right? I, I think so, the, your, your session is meant to be interactive, right? Yeah, yeah sure. Be interactive, so, actually. Like, be interactive, be common, like, it's just have fun. There's no way we're going to, to, to be connected as a community if you don't do that, because it's so essential, like, it's so, so important during community sessions. For us, actually, for our connection, for our networking. Well, maybe you, you can push it to, say, 3.30, 2.30, around there. Okay. Yeah, that's my we'll suggestion. Look. We're gonna look into that and see. Gideon, you want you have something to say about this as well? Yep. Uh, good morning. Yes, good morning. I hope you are you are doing well on your side. I'm well on my side. Um, yes. Sir. 
what I think about these community community building sessions uh, have been through such platforms, and uh, I can say maybe this one is not much engaging because it's just something to do with texting, writing. But if you could do something like a speed dating, I think mm -hmm. it will help. We have a speed speed dating session where maybe uh, maybe the platform matches me with uh, maybe another member of the platform we chat for like five minutes and it's over then it connects me to another person then it will be much engaging do you think uh what do you think about uh doing it here on, on google Meet? uh google meet i'm not sure about it because okay the, the platform i was using actually i don't know the name of the platform uh but it, it it is usually like a, a speed dating session where you are just matched with a person for five minutes, you chat, you talk, then when the five okay. minutes elapse, it's over. So, so I'm not I sure get you. Uh, Google Meet has that uh, function. I got you, but still let's use what we have as well, but we can still like, you know, interact with each other on Slack. Maybe it's timing, yeah. but yeah, I understand that. But see, anytime you get, just check what's going on there, you know. Yeah, so let's let's just dive into our open space to everyone. Like, what was the challenge yesterday? What did you do? Is there any maybe problem, is there any issue? What are you up to, to do today? Yeah, let's open to everyone. Yes, uh, uh, Tasnelde. Yeah, um, I have a question on the peer to peer grouping. What are we really supposed to do there? You mean just, in the, yeah. the CBS, right? Yes. Yeah, it's just like interaction, like, you know, these CBS are there for us to interact, for us to connect, for us to build this community where we're able to you not know, know more each other, you know, help each other, be friends. It's networking, because if I'm coming to Nigeria, you're from Nigeria, right? If I'm coming to Nigeria, I remember there's someone from Ten Academy here in Nigeria, uh -huh. or something. So it's there for us to interact, to, to connect, to build this con this community because we are here together in two days together so we should have this community we should have these connections you know it's just there to even relax if you have a question if you have anything a joke something like that okay okay that. and are we grouping according to the our maybe interest like let me say the person in the computer or information something uh, like no that. no no there's no such like that we are all in the, there like everyone challenge oh. uh, anyone oh. yeah you know, okay, good. thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for the good questions. So let's just have an open space for everyone now. Like challenges, then a challenge, maybe starting from the chat box. Submission link will be available if it was okay. Yeah, I think he this one has been insisted. Okay. So do we have any any other problem or a challenge or anything? You can just open your mic and speak. Maybe use the chat box if you can speak. But it's more good if you speak. Yeah. Challenges like how was yesterday? Maybe what's your plan today? Anyone, anyone? People are shy. People are shy. Why would people be shy? So, Cindy. <laughs> Hello? Yes. Oh, Why do you think I'm people not... are shy? I don't think they're shy to speak. Maybe occupied or there's no challenge anymore. I'm not facing challenge from my side. <laughs> okay, so there's no challenge. Yeah, it's from my side. Fantastic. That means everything is going well, smoothly. For, for, for my own side, I don't see it as a challenge, but I think um, combining the 20 hours challenge, the 20 hours a week, and um, meeting up with other obligations that is on a various table, or that is on my own table, let me speak for myself, have uh, been quite um, um, challenging, but I'm trying very hard to, um, to, to manage the expectations for instance as i speak now as this meeting is going on 
I'm busy combining the data for the submission that is meant to be submitted today. So I think we are we are having a nice time, but not everybody has um, this data. Um, uh, what's it called? Origin before. Perhaps that's the challenge. But I'm fine. I'm cool. I'm enjoying myself. Okay. It's it's good that you're enjoying and probably you're learning something from that. Okay. So absolutely, I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm learning. That's amazing. That's amazing. So should we just conclude that? Okay, there's something in the chat box. Okay, it's from the Twin Academy team. Yeah, yeah. So should we just conclude that there's no challenge today? Like yesterday was cool. Everything like was fine. There's no challenge. There's no any problem. But if there's no challenges, then that means there's solutions. People can see it speak, right? I think like. Just anything. How was yesterday in general? Just yes, how was it yesterday? Maybe at work, at home, anywhere. This is just checking. This is stand up meeting. This we checking on each other. See like what's going on there. Okay. Okay. Seems like today is cool. Okay, all right. So, do we have maybe any other announcements, Makira, or maybe anyone from the team? Makira, do you have anything to say? Um, I just wanted to go over the schedule. Hi, everyone. I hope you guys are doing well. So, let me just go through the schedule for today. Um, so uh, we'll be having uh, a tutorial on introduction to financial indicators um, today at the um, building station for that, and we'll have a career challenge introduction. That's what it was. Well, that's for the career challenge. So Miriam will get to that uh, during the session. So yeah, today. Uh, so submit. Sorry. Submission. Yes. Come. come I think again. you were breaking. You you were oh. breaking. I thought maybe it's on my side, but yeah, you were breaking. Oh okay. My connection. Still breaking. I hope maybe uh, the network. Yeah, she's trying again. <laughs> so, yes, Kone. Yes, uh, are you hear me? Yeah, sure. Yes, before she comes back, I have a question. I I put it in the in the chat, but I not I'm not uh, satisfied with the response. It's about the data we will, we are going to collect and submit today. I want to know if we should um, convert it in like a word document and then in PDF, or can we just submit it as a Excel sheet? Because they provided us um, an essay ship that we should follow. So that's why I'm I'm just asking. Okay. Please go on. Uh, yes, Makir, we can hear you now. Good. Okay. Just to answer for uh I'm not sure if I'm saying your name right, but so the submission for the okay, going to be for the essay is going to be in PDF. You can just save it as PDF and then submit that. You don't have to copy it to a uh, Word document. And so uh, what I was saying earlier was just going through the schedule that we're going to have a tutorial session on introduction to financial indicators. Uh, and then we'll have a tutorial on career challenge introduction. So uh, someone asked in the comment section about the good thing that was paid yesterday. So that's and we'll have the entrance submission today. And submission will be a couple three hours. 
for the section. So that's around uh, 6 p.m. EAT, after 6 p.m. EAT. So you'll find the link available by then. Um, so that was uh, the announcement that I wanted to make, Million, Thank you. That's for me. All right. Thank you. Uh, Kone, are you good now? Yes, yes. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Do you have any other question, maybe, or any other challenge? Okay. Uh, Ohunene, then Kefiwe. Yeah. Ohunene, then Kefiwe. Let's go. Ohunene. Yeah. Good morning. I just have a question about the tasks. Um, for the prompts that we had in task one, they're like a list of prompts that were given. But when you go to the um, the Excel sheets that was given, it says like on thirty first December for some of them. But I didn't do that. I just used the list. That was given in the beginning. Do we have to add the dates like on 31st December to some of them? Okay. Do you understand what I'm asking? Um, can, you, can you repeat your question? Please. In the, okay, I will. In the, in the task, they gave like a list of prompts that were supposed to add in Copilot, right? But when you click the, how would I say it? The, <laughs> it's, I'm coming. I'll come back to this question. Let someone else ask. Maybe you can consider typing them down in the chat box. Is that fine, maybe? Oh, Nene. Okay. Maybe should we come back with the question? Uh, Kefi, Kefirwe. I'm sorry okay. if I didn't mention your name correctly. Yes, it's yes. Kefirwe. Okay. Good morning. Yes. I need clarity on this part. Uh, where it says ensure you have converted and represented billions, millions, and trillions consistently. Does it mean if I choose billions, I have to make sure each and every sheet is in billions? Or if I choose millions, it means each and every sheet I should convert every value to millions. I want to understand that this part. Thank you. Okay, Makira, do you have an answer for her? Okay, so... Okay. For example, yes, let's say, okay, I just want to answer the question. So we, we have given uh, the template, right? So in the template, you have, uh, let's say you are you are asking or you are prompting in billions, but uh, and also for other, you have the response in millions. So you have to actually make it consistent or or otherwise you have to actually convert each 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 input into different uh in different let's say trillions millions and billions so it, it has to be consistent so for example if you are using billions you have to convert the values correctly in billions and let's say for cash on hand your response was in trillions so you have to convert that into billions but for uh, revenue you have that uh in uh, in trillions, so we have to convert that. So make it consistent. That was the point. Yes, I uh, think I understand. But if, okay. if, for example, if I take Microsoft, for example, and I have Microsoft all in billions, then it's fine. I can have Apple in trillions, it's fine. I can have the other company in millions, it's fine. Or I can have millions in all companies. Uh, because uh, looking at this one, I for example, just, just, uh, yeah, you just um, make make it like consistent throughout the throughout the company. Yeah, 
not throughout, throughout the, the campaign. The whole, awesome. Yeah, make make it through that. But specifically, you have to mention it. So if it's in trillions, you have to uh, explicitly mention it is it's in tri in trillions. So you can't actually tell if it's in millions or or not. So you have okay. you have to explicitly uh, put it in your report or in your research. Okay. Understandable. Yes. Thank you. All right, thank you so much. Okay, uh, so we have uh, the file, then on any the file. You can go. Okay, uh, thank you. Good morning, everyone. Uh, my question is uh, some of companies cannot provide all uh, yes. financial. Sorry. There is a file, there's a lot of noise, this background noise. You can hear you. Okay, sorry. So, Rufail, maybe you can actually type it on Slack. Okay. Yeah. okay. All right. Okay, thank you. So, Onini, do you have your question now? Yes. In task one in the Google Doc, it says run the following prompt so there are some prompts that were given like give me a table with cash on hand for company but when we go to the data templates in google sheets it says cash on hand usd 31st december market capitalization usd on this first december so were we supposed to add those to our prompts when we first do the prompts or is that unnecessary? Like, I'm trying to understand. So that means just, you know, it's better if you put it, but if not, the data you will get is the same as the data, oh. which was in, oh. in the last of 31st December. So for example, the 2018 data represents 2018, end of 2018, which is 31st of December, as of 31st December oh okay so it, it, it doesn't matter if you put it or not it, that, that just was uh it, it was just there for clarification purposes since every uh end of year means just uh 31st december and okay yeah so uh, which uh, means about end of the fiscal year about the question she asked i faced the same challenge yesterday and when I used the tool, the data were not were not consistent. And I think I asked on slide, and uh, they suggested something, but I've not I've not tried the new one because now yesterday when I uh, when I did it, the the data were not were not consistent. So I don't know what was not consistent specifically for which company for for the for the example she she just showed now. The hand one um, hand one cash. There was one. I just used the prompt that were provided in the um, doc sheet. And for the second one, I added USD 31st December for the same for the same company. And the data I I got were not consistent. Okay, for what year? For all the five years. Yes. Yes. yes, for all the five years, yes. Ah, okay. That might be uh, the problem with, uh, I don't know, maybe as you are getting uh, different results from different sources. Just uh, try to use uh, the most recent results. And if you have any uh, any way to clarify that or to actually check if it's correct or not, that maybe Copilot is just doing a search, so you, have, you, you can also do a search and uh, clarify that which one was correct or not. If you have uh, this, this is for all of you, for all the trainees. If you are getting a, an inconsistent result, try to verify it yourself. Since Copilot is just pulling it, pulling it from the internet, you can just check it for us. So make sure to use the, the correct or the verified one. If you can verify it, good. If you can't, just put the most recent result you got. 
Is that clear, Colin? Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. And for uh, Rufail's question, uh, may, maybe uh, if you are, if if any of the informations are not provided, try to change uh, company. And if you, if that not, if that is not possible, just put uh, put uh, any in in your call. So, for example, for cash on hand for alphabet, if it's uh, if it's not found, just put not found. But make sure you have, you have looked for because when we actually when we are, when we are checking for uh, alphabet, if we find cash on hand result, you just you, you didn't look for it. So make sure you look for it correctly and uh, you took time on it. So just put not found if it's if you if it's uh, if any is uh, a result. So I hope that's clear for you five. Okay. Okay. So for the Nebenagar's question, if, uh, as I've as I've mentioned uh, earlier, for the Rufael's question, make sure you have uh, you look for it. Uh, you try try again and again, and if the result is still not found, just put more. But make sure you have, you actually try. Okay. All right. Thank you so much, Nathaniel. Uh, we have Abdulaziz. Abdulaziz. Yeah. Thank you. Hello. Thank you. Uh, is week to challenge uh, submission open on the platform? I mean, uh, where where to submit? Uh, I'm asking where to submit on this, this uh, the assignment. Okay, uh, I think they have asked that question in the chat box, and the answer was the submission link for two week, uh, week two interim submission will be available three hours before submission time today. I don't okay. know if that was the same answer. I mean, the same question, right? Does that does that help? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. All right. Thank you so much. Uh, do we have any other? question any other challenge okay so everyone is good now oh nene like are you good like did you get the answer yes i did thank you all right thank you so much so uh, i think that's it for today let's end up our stand up today so we have the tutorial in like 27 minutes to come yeah Let's attend on time. Thank you so much and bye.